Professor Robert, who happens to be a black belt in jiu-jitsu, also is a black belt on the grill. He is here helping Stearns and I up our steak game, take it to the next level. We have our red cups, of course, because that's how dads <laughs> do it when they're in the kitchen. I'm gonna tell you what I do to make my steak. Mm -hmm. it's, it's straight out ghetto, but it works <laughs> for me, but I know you can help me out. I put salt, I put pepper, I put garlic, I put a little balsamic vinegar, believe it or not, and then I put a little beer. Okay. All right? Then I throw it on the grill, and when it looks done, I you think it's it. done. I take it out and I it. eat it. When, you, when it looks done, you yeah, eat it. Yeah. Right. I do I do a cast iron. Mm -hmm. So I like to do a cast iron and get it hot, use butter, kind of baste it, that kind of thing. Yeah. We're going to take out some ribeyes and we're going to show you how I would prepare it and how I would do it for the steak cook-off. I think today would also be a steak championship because we're going to have our girls taste them at the end. See who is judges. the real champ. Steak, taking it to the next level. Here we go. All right, Professor, take us through it. Step one, we've got some brontosaurus this looking burgers right here. This is some Flintstone stuff this right here. This is some Flintstone yes, stuff, Flintstone. yes. <laughs> what we're looking at is three rib ribeyes. And, um, you know, when we go to pick the steaks, like I tend to tend to choose ribeye. This Ri is the one that we want? I think ribeye is the easiest. This is flat, it's easy, and really it only takes about six minutes. It Great. looks beautiful. I wanted to talk about the grade really quick. Um, PCS, just remember that. Prime, choice, and select. Don't get all scientific. I'm sorry, on this. No, yeah. <laughs> okay. but there's a reason. <laughs> okay. You can almost always find choice in the store. Okay. Uh, As a prime, little sticker. Yeah. Prime is going to be more expensive. It's going to be better marbled. Okay. Select. Yeah. We're going to make a little bit of a steak butter. It's really simple. Is this uh, salted or unsalted? Salted butter. Very good. Salted you, butter. You have I love to use salted butter. Salted. When, yeah. just, when you get a piece of bread and you get like this whip kind oh, of soft man, butter, right? you throw some salt yeah, on it. It's delicious. What? Next so, level. I need you to chop that. I have rosemary and a little bit of thyme, and then this guy here. Really, all I want out of this is just a little bit of juice. So you just want a little bit in there. Breathe it? Yeah, just a little bit there. That's plenty. Good. A little bit of thyme. And then when that's done, just throw that in there. Go ahead and with the, with the fork, just whip that together. This is how it looked in restaurants. Yeah, man. Yes. It's like, this um, is how it looked in restaurants. No wonder. The butter is a finishing butter. So when we plate it, we're going to put a little disc of it on there, and it's going to melt off while the steak's nice and hot. And it's going to kind of base the top of it and give you a little, that's plenty. It looks very that's professional. Now this, that, this is the butter that, that is on your you restaurant. You know if like, this dollop is on there, it's going to be good. Now this is that next level has to go in here. Wait, on there? Yep. OK. Oh. Because it's going to be cold. Yep, put that right in the middle oh, there. Right on. I can't wait to any. But there you go. Perfect. So now, this is just a piece of wax paper or parchment paper. And then we just make like oh, a little. Oh, like you're a making little a burrito out want. of the butter. Why are you making a burrito out of the See, butter? This is the very so that when we cut it, we get a disc of it. So we make a little butter tootsie pop. Like that. Look at tootsie roll. <laughs> tootsie roll. <laughs> and that goes in the fridge. It just goes in the fridge. Stick that in the fridge. Okay. That butter, by the way, we make it cold, and then these are hot, and then tss, yeah, it melts exactly. on it. Ooh. Look at that right there. It's so melts good. right on Look it. At that. Beautiful. We just need to salt and pepper. I know you use a lot of stuff, and then you wash it off with beer. And then I do a little bit of beer. Yeah. <laughs> you wash well, it off. I, I, I like to say I bathe it. You bathe I it. Well, that I bathe it. Like a but I think he's saying that you're washing you're off washing the salt and pepper and all that because just, as soon as you put yeah, beer really? on it, it takes it off. Is that yeah. what's happening? Just, yeah. Is it just salt and pepper? Salt I mean, pepper. is that all you need? Really? Salt and pepper. Really? I if you have a good piece of steak, you just need... Why, why would you add a lot of flavor to something that you... Like, if I want to eat a piece of beef, I want to eat a piece of beef. I know, but I'm Mexican, so I just put a lot of spices on it. <laughs> just because I have That's because you've been eating pork all the time. I have it, exactly. <laughs> so yeah, we're just going to add some salt and pepper. All now, right, the Now, wow, the question is what kind of salt? Yeah. Um, always run with kosher salt. Uh, almost all other kosher, kosher salt. salt. I'm using salt to try to bring out as much flavor as I can and try to get some water out of this and try to um, really just bump up the flavor with it. Ah, That's what so the salt is for. It's just complementing what's already in there. It's not yeah. the flavor, it's to kind of Seas bring it out. Keep it simple. Correct. Keep it simple. Yeah. That's right. With pepper, coarse ground, as coarse as you can get um, is best. Um, doesn't have to be like cracked pepper, but uh -huh. that, that works really well too. Okay, so show us how much we should use for a citrus, please. Are you gonna throw a salt bay move right now? <laughs> <laughs> you throw a salt bay, I'm gonna trip out. No, but what I am gonna do is just make sure that I get a particular amount that I want in it. So when I do it, I don't go really high. Obviously the higher you are, the greater the spread. Right. And I don't go like right on top of it. Okay. But I do just kind of crack it and make sure that you get mm. a proper dusting of it. Same concept. I just get pepper out, Smart. You put it first. and I do it just with my hand. Flip it and do the other side, just to get it. Just to get it going. 
Is that better? It worked. It does, yes, it works famously. Here, what's next step? Cook it. Oh, that's okay. it part. It's I mean, it, it just rests for a few minutes, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make sure the grill's about 500 degrees. And that part's really technical, which you hold your hand over it. If you can keep it there for a second, or three seconds, or five seconds. If it's one second or two seconds, you got it about right. Well, let's grill it. So what you're gonna do, you take it over to the grill, okay. and you're gonna put it on just like this. No um, butter for, oil, anything on the grill, you just, just... For 90 just... seconds, you put it on like that. 90 seconds later, you turn it 45 degrees. Okay. Oh. 90 seconds later, you flip it over. 90 seconds later, you turn it 45, 45 degrees oh. again. So you get a little diamond pattern on it. 90, 90, oh. 90. The total cook time, it should be about six minutes. These are pretty thick, which means you're gonna have some give or take. We wanna pull them off when they're about 128. Okay, and which give gives you? Rest to medium rare. Medium rare. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so let's All make right. sure the grill's hot. Let's do it. All right. So we've hit about 500 on here, you know, give or take. Okay. So are you doing medium for a certain amount of time or is it just, Ooh. wow. Get it hot. hot. That's hot. Get like it, get it hot one, and then leave it like that. You know, okay. whatever, like this thing heats up really, really well, insulates yeah. really well. Yeah, you're grilling. Ooh. All right. Wow, that's hot. Wow. Yeah, nice, I like that. Remember? Yeah, I'm gonna go down go here. Now the shape that you put them on there in yeah. is the shape that they're gonna cook in. 90 and seconds. That is. Get a little timer going here. Now we awkwardly stand here for 90 seconds. <laughs> I'll throw you great. one of these real quick. Yeah. Is this just to get the grill marks on it? Or is Purely there grill marks. It's, no, so it's, it's not nothing. It's a just, cooking. Yeah, nothing at all. Okay. Why not cook it with some cool marks? That's, I agree. If I it's agree. not, if, how do you know it's That's on the like grill? That's like how you paint your hair. Mark. It's still your hair. You just got to paint it the right color. What do you want? Yours? I want mine like medium rare, more on the rare side. Okay. So I'm going to hit it at 90 degrees, just right? Not 45, over. 45. Oh, 45 degrees. Yep, okay. that's it. Just like that. That's it. And then do that one too. You got to get all of them, buddy. Oh, that it's hot. Okay. Get that well, one too. Get that one while no, you're you there, that player. It's hot. It's hot. My hand is hot. See? <laughs> that's it. Don't touch it. That's great. You touch it once. Okay. But did you see too that they didn't stick? Ooh, the smell, wow, by the, the way. smell now the is, smell getting, is, is getting Ooh, great. The smell right? makes you want to. Hey, <laughs> there it is. Oh. See, we got this. Get rid of If the grill's not hot enough, it will stick, correct? It will. Yes, okay. Because you're searing it pretty much. You're heating, you're cooking over such a high heat that you are getting a sear. Right. Right? So you have 30 seconds until you got to flip off. And the most important thing to think about at this point when you're making a steak is, is it all timing right now? Yes. It's all timing. And so patience. you got to be aware. You can't walk away to watch, check the score of the game. No, 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 no. You can't That's do that. Cute. Okay, we got to go. Flip your Come steaks. Come on, timing. Team, teamwork. Flip your steaks. Look at that guy. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Flip that one. What's with the flames? Oh, it's hot. I told you. Gosh. <laughs> Wait, what's with the flames? Oh, oh my God. Oh. Come on. I'm, That's not the professional I'm such an there. amateur. Wait, how'd you do that all cool? Why, why is there flames coming out of there? <laughs> Generally speaking, do you want to cook it with the lid down or up? Yes, down. 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 Most people seem to cook it up, right? I just want to keep staring at it. Huh. I don't know why. And do you, do you cook it? What does that do when you cook it up? It's just... Well, what's happening is you're getting two types of heat. Uh, Here we go. You're getting direct <laughs> heat from the flame up. Got it. And you're getting, you're getting radiant and convection heat that's coming around the top and back around the top. Wow. So you're getting two different types of heat. right here. I know. But dang, I, yeah, I, lost, some, you lost, I lost some hair in my hand right there. <laughs> okay, what am I, what's the next 30 move? seconds, we 30 turn seconds. it 45. Do you want to do it or are you going to be ready? I'm going to do it. I'm going to got to man up again. 45. 45, 45, 45. There it don't is. Don't drag it. Try to pick the whole oh, thing don't try, up. Don't, don't drag, drag it. Drag okay, it. Yeah, I didn't know how to drag it. I'll pick it up. And then turn it. Yeah. Oh, see, see, Oh, that was beautiful. Look at this. Ah, I redeemed myself. We're doing medium rare, medium, and medium-ish. Get that, that one, one off. And put it over there. That was quick. This is quick. This one right there. Whoa, you're going to lose it. You're going to lose it. Now another 10 seconds, we'll get the next one. <laughs> oh, damn, that smells good. What can we do for 10 seconds? You check your Instagram feed, <laughs> we can do that. Post Ready? Now when you grab this next one, try to grab towards the center of it. When you grab towards the end, it's just gonna tear apart. Okay. Ready? Ready. Grab the center one. Right about there, yep. Oh! Oh, so a thing that of one beauty! Is, so that's meat. Oh, oh, a thing of beauty! Oh, oh, Are you sure that Lord. one's cooked enough? That one looks like it's bleeding still. This is so carnivorous. I love it. <laughs> All right, go for it. Oh! Oh! oh, oh. Go get it! Get over oh, there. damn! Why is there flame still on it? What is going on? I mean, look—it's still burning. What was the flames going on? Was that too hot? Was the grill too crazy? <laughs> no. So the fat rendered out, right? Yes. And flamed up, flared up, Got and it. you get a hot flare on it, and there it goes. You're gonna I want to cut one open. Let's cut one open and see what they're, We're gonna get what they're like. You know, you can kind of see 
what the difference 10 seconds makes. And again, this one here, a little bit thicker That's than the other turns. one. That's his turns. I'm liking this one. They're yeah. all good. I'll eat all of them, but I'm just saying. Yeah. And it's that, it's like, it's 10 seconds. Yeah, I mean, it makes all the so you have to be so, so if you're slipping, adamant about, yes, if yeah. you're slipping for one second. That's it. Let's get a test and get some professionals in here. Bring the professionals in. And let's get some judges going. All right. Kiddos. All right, buddy. Try a piece. That's your piece right there. Get that. Get that with the with the, with the the fork. Get that with that fork. OK. Stab it. There you go. That a boy. Come on, come on, come on. Not bad. I know. Wait, you're going to. Yeah, Look at this one. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, get in there. Get that little one, mama. Is that delicious? Yeah, go ahead. All right, I'm gonna take this one right here. <laughs> yeah. All right, hold up your paddle. Hold up your paddles. What do you all say? Go to the camera. Hold up your paddle. Five. 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 Oh, nice. Eight stars. How many stars I got? I gotta get more. You liked it? And the butter, it's got butter and the yeah. you like that. Nico, butter. what did you think about it? I like the flavor yes. and I like the taste. Yes. Well, you like the, the flavor and the and taste. taste. See, it's it's connoisseur taste. over here. I want more of that. That's Me the best too. compliment right there. Me too. If a four-year-old wants you more, just... I'm going to give you more. I'm going to give you more, my little carnivore right yeah. here. All right, I big go shout out to Professor Robert showing us how to have thrills with the grill right here. We know how to take our steaks to the next level. Give it a shot, try it out. Dad's in the kitchen, please let us know. Lopez Family Channel, please subscribe. Bye guys, say bye. 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 Dad's in the kitchen.